I'm going to guide you step by step on how to create a stunning portfolio on Behance. Behance is a creative platform where you can showcase your work, whether you're into photography, graphic design, web development, or even architecture. It's an amazing tool to display your skills and get noticed by potential clients and employers. So, let's get started. To create a portfolio on Behance, the first thing you need to do is sign up. Go to Behance.net and you'll land on the homepage, where you can easily create an account using your Google, Facebook, or even Apple ID. If you're ready to start, simply sign up and log in. Once you're in, you'll be taken to your feed. This is the place where you can follow other artists, discover creative work, and get inspiration. Behance is full of talented people from around the world, and you'll get access to a lot of fantastic portfolios. Now, what sets Behance apart is that it's not just a platform to showcase your work. It's also a place where you can get hired, collaborate, and even find freelance gigs. So, your Behance portfolio could serve as your digital resume, helping you get opportunities. Once you've signed into Behance, it's time to dive into creating your first project. Behance provides multiple options to present your work in different formats, whether you're a designer, artist, or any other creative professional. Building a portfolio on Behance is straightforward and allows you to share your projects with the world. At the top of the page, you'll find the Share Your Work button. Clicking this opens a menu with several options, showcase your freelance offerings, and others. These choices cater to various needs depending on the type of work you're presenting. For a well-rounded portfolio that explains your design process. This option enables you to break down your work into sections, share the background, your approach, and results offering an engaging story of your project. Once you've selected your project type, you can start adding content. This is where you'll start customizing your portfolio to reflect your creative expertise. To start off, you'll likely want to add some text to your project to provide context. To do this, simply click on the text button in the project editor. This will open up a space where you can describe your work in detail. Whether you're outlining the creative journey behind your project, explaining the tools you used, or sharing the challenges you overcame, this is where you'll give viewers insight into your process. This text is key to making your project not just visually appealing, but also informative. Make sure the text is engaging, clear, and professional. A strong project description will captivate your audience and add depth to your visual work. For example, if you're showcasing a branding project, you might explain your thought process behind the logo design, the target audience, and how you arrived at the final look. Beyond just adding text, you can also customize it to fit your desired style. Behance allows you to adjust the font, size, color, and even the alignment of your text. You can format it to make it look cohesive with the rest of your portfolio, whether you prefer a more minimalist style or something bold and creative. Don't forget to break your text into smaller paragraphs or bullet points for readability, especially if you're sharing complex information. Providing clear and professional text alongside your visuals helps give your project the necessary context. It also makes it easier for potential clients or employers to understand your approach and vision. This balance of engaging visuals and informative text is key to creating a standout portfolio on Behance. Once you've added your project description, the next step is to bring your work to life by showcasing your visuals. To do this, simply click on the image button in the project editor, and you'll be prompted to upload images from your computer. This could include anything from photographs and screenshots to design mock-ups, product renders, or even digital artwork, anything that helps convey the essence of your project. After uploading your images, 
You can easily adjust their size and position within your project. Behance lets you click on each image to modify it, whether it's resizing to fit your layout, cropping it for a cleaner look, or adjusting the alignment to maintain a consistent design. Additionally, you have the option to add borders around your images, giving them a polished, professional appearance that blends seamlessly with the overall look of your portfolio. For more comprehensive project presentations, you can also attach additional assets to each image. For instance, if you're showcasing a design mock-up, you might want to include a downloadable PDF of the full presentation or any supporting documents, like client feedback or a project timeline. Attaching files like these helps provide extra context and shows the depth of your work. Images and visuals are essential to communicate your creative process effectively, and Behance makes it easy to upload, organize, and customize them. By showcasing not only the final product but also providing additional resources and documentation, you give potential clients or employers a deeper understanding of your capabilities and approach. Whether you're showing off web designs, photography, or branding work, this visual focus is what will set your portfolio apart. For photographers or anyone working with visual media, Behance offers a photo grid. This feature is perfect for showcasing multiple images at once. It's clean, organized, and easy to navigate. You can even integrate images from Lightroom if you're using Adobe Creative Cloud, which syncs directly to Behance. If you're a videographer or someone who works with sound, you can upload videos or even audio files. Click on video slash audio and upload directly from your computer or embed from platforms like YouTube or Vimeo. For example, if you're showcasing a short film, this would be a great way to include it in your portfolio. Another powerful feature that sets Behance apart is the embed option. This feature allows you to seamlessly integrate content from a variety of external platforms, enhancing your portfolio by including interactive elements or multimedia. For instance, if you've created a prototype in Figma or Adobe XD, you can embed it directly into your Behance project, allowing potential clients or collaborators to interact with it in real time. But it doesn't stop there. Behance also supports embedding videos from platforms like YouTube or Vimeo, making it easy to showcase your process videos, animation reels, or even client testimonials. If you've created digital art or collectibles, you can also embed NFTs, giving viewers the chance to explore your work in an engaging, immersive way. Embedding these types of content helps add a dynamic layer to your portfolio. It's one thing to showcase a static image of a design, but with the ability to embed interactive prototypes or animated clips, you provide a richer, more engaging experience for anyone viewing your work. This interactivity not only makes your portfolio stand out but also gives potential clients or employers a better understanding of your design process and skills. It's an excellent way to show off your technical expertise and creativity in a way that goes beyond traditional images and text. Once you've added all your content, it's time to fine-tune the overall appearance and layout of your portfolio to ensure it aligns with your personal style and the message you want to convey. Customizing the look and feel is a crucial step, as it helps make your project stand out and provides a more engaging user experience. Start by adjusting the layout of your project to make it visually appealing. Behance gives you the option to choose between different templates and grid systems to display your work in a neat, organized manner. You can choose a full screen display for an immersive effect or a more structured grid layout for a cleaner look. This flexibility allows you to showcase your project exactly how you envision it. To make your portfolio truly reflect your unique style and professional identity, customizing the background color is key. Click on the Style tab to access various options, 
and select a background color that aligns with your branding. Whether you prefer a subtle, neutral tone to let your work shine, or a bold, vibrant color that makes a statement, this choice will set the tone for the entire project. Choosing the right color helps create a cohesive look, ensuring that your portfolio feels consistent and polished throughout. In addition to background color, you can tweak other design elements to reinforce your branding. Adjusting the font style, size, and color can further unify your portfolio, giving it a clean, professional finish. For instance, if you've established a brand identity with specific fonts and colors, incorporating those elements into your portfolio will make it instantly recognizable to potential clients or employers. It's also important to think about the overall mood you want to convey. Light, airy colors might give a more minimalist, modern vibe, while darker tones can exude sophistication and professionalism. The key is to strike a balance between creativity and clarity, making sure that your portfolio doesn't overwhelm visitors, but rather guides them through your work seamlessly. One of the key elements in making your portfolio look more professional is adjusting the spacing between the various elements. Whether it's between images, text, or other types of content, spacing helps create balance and ensures your portfolio doesn't feel too crowded or overwhelming. By giving each element room to breathe, your portfolio will appear cleaner and easier to navigate. Experiment with different margins and padding to find the right balance. If you place images close together, they might feel cramped, so adding a bit more space can make the visuals stand out more. Similarly, adjusting the space between text blocks can make reading your project descriptions smoother and less cluttered. This fine-tuning will allow you to guide the viewer's eye naturally through your portfolio highlighting key aspects of your work without distraction. It's also a great way to emphasize certain sections, like placing extra space around a featured project to draw attention to it. Your portfolio will need a thumbnail, the small image that people see when they discover your project. Choose an image that accurately represents your work and will catch the eye of potential clients or collaborators. Once you've fine-tuned your content and design, it's time to put the finishing touches on your Behance portfolio. One of the most important steps is adding tags to your project. Behance allows you to include up to 10 tags, and these can significantly boost the visibility of your work. Tags are search terms that help potential clients, collaborators, and recruiters find your portfolio when looking for specific types of projects. For instance, if you're a web developer, you might use tags like UI slash UX, website design, or front-end development. Tags are your way of telling Behance's search algorithm what your project is about, helping it reach the right audience. Next, under the Tools Use section, make sure to list all the software and platforms you use to create your work. This is especially important for industries like design, photography, and video production, where specific tools are often associated with quality work. For example, if you use programs like Adobe Photoshop, Sketch, or Final Cut Pro, include these in your portfolio. Not only does this showcase your technical skills, but it also helps viewers understand your proficiency with industry standard tools. It can be a powerful way to demonstrate your expertise and can even make a big difference when potential clients or employers are evaluating your work. Once everything is set, you're almost ready to publish. But before you hit publish, you can choose to make your project public or private. If you want the world to see your portfolio, set it to public. You can also restrict visibility to only people you invite if you prefer a more private sharing option. When you're ready, click Publish, and your project will be live on Behance. You've now got a professional portfolio that can help showcase your skills to potential clients and collaborators. Apart from creating your portfolio, 
Behance offers other features that can enhance your experience. If you're working on a project and want feedback, you can create a work-in-progress post. This allows others to comment and provide suggestions while you're still in the process of creating. Behance also offers live streaming, which allows you to showcase your creative process in real time. This is especially helpful for designers or illustrators who want to connect with their audience while they work. As a freelancer, Behance doubles as a job board. Many companies post opportunities here, and you can apply directly through the platform. You can also use Behance to hire other talented individuals for your projects. Once your portfolio is live, it's time to promote it. Share the link on your social media profiles, personal website, or even email signature. Behance projects are highly shareable, and the more people who see your work, the better your chances of getting noticed. You can also join Behance groups related to your niche, interact with other creatives, and build a community around your work. The more active you are within the Behance ecosystem, the more visibility you'll get. If you're looking to monetize your portfolio, Behance makes it easy to sell assets directly through your profile. You can upload digital products like templates, presets, or design resources that people can purchase and download. This is a great way to earn income from your creative work. Creating a portfolio on Behance is an excellent way to showcase your work to the world. Whether you're a designer, photographer, video editor, or any other type of creative, Behance offers all the tools you need to display your skills in a professional and organized way.